close to the elusive 100 subscribers. Everybody, welcome to May. I think it's the 12th, but let me just verify what day is. It is May 12th, 2017. I'm coming to you from the parking lot of my daughter's daycare. Today, I think I'm going to call this vlog It's My Day Off, but it's really not my day off. I have so much I have to do today. I have to get, I gotta call GE to get my dishwasher fixed. I gotta call Anar, who um, developed our house, who uh, built our house because we have a problem with our banister. It's like shaking a little bit, like loose. I'm not sure how it got loose, but it's loose. So, you know, when we bought the house, we have this uh, one year warranty from Lenar that they'll come fix anything at any time for free. So, I'm gonna do that. And then I gotta go pick up my son from Las Vegas High School, which is on the way on the other side of town. And I can do that by 12.30. And I wanted to wash my car and clean my car today. And then somewhere along the way, I have to put stuff on eBay. And then somewhere along the way there, I need to take my nap. Cause right now I'm freaking tired. I don't know why. Cause I feel fine. I feel like I'm recovering a little bit from the sickness. And I'm a little fatigued, but there's no weary for the rest, guys. No weary for the rest. Things first again. Let's do something about this gas because I have that much gas left. I think this many miles left before I'm stuck. So let's get some gas. So while I'm sitting here waiting to get my gas pump, check this out. I just looked at my YouTube channel. Check this out, guys. I am close to the elusive 100 subscribers. It's so funny when I started doing this, I just did it just to have, just to do it. And I wasn't really worried too much about having subscribers and stuff. I mean, I, I wanted subscribers. I wanted people to watch my videos, but I didn't like really advertise my channel too much. I mean, I put it on my Facebook and Twitter, but nothing really major. Like I didn't do any sub for sub and all that garbage. I just, I wanted my channel to be organically found. If you like, I want the people who subscribe to my channel to people that like my channel, that will watch my channel. And if it means not having as many subscribers as I, as I wanted, then I'd be okay with it. And look at this. It's uh, 99. I started August 19th, I believe. Today is May 12th. So it's taking me eight months to get this many subscribers. And... Believe me, I don't regret anything about how I've worked my YouTube channel. Not one bit. I know I had a guy um, a while back question why I'm doing this. Like, because I don't have that many subscribers. And I, and I told him straight up, you know, because I like doing it. Basically, I like doing the daily vlogs. You know, it, it'd be nice to have a million subscribers, but that's, that's, the, that's not the way I'm thinking right now. So... Yeah, this is kind of cool that I am one more subscriber away from 100. Let's, let, let's update it see maybe it's 100 now. Uh, no, never mind. <laughs> and hopefully it'll continue to grow and people like you guys who are watching it will continue to support this channel. And believe me, I am eternally grateful for each and every one of you guys. I really, really am. So it's now, uh, what time is it now? It is 11, 18 in the a.m. Uh, I just took a quick nap. It's funny because when I got home, uh, Lenar, the people who built this home that we live in now, came by and inspected the uh, stuff that had problems with. We have like a loose banister and a, a dishwasher's not draining. And it turns out I have to call GE itself to have, a, to have that thing arranged. And then for the banister, it was I guess it was just their... Um, we call it the uh, liaison kind of uh, the go-between because he's actually got to call the company that's going to come by next week 
to fix our banister. So my dishwasher and my banister won't be fixed till next Friday instead of today. Which is, you know, it's, it's not really a big deal. It's more of an inconvenience than anything else. Then uh, I got a call from my daughter, I mean my stepdaughter, saying that she about, she's going to pick up my son from school. So I don't have to drive all the way across town to pick him up. So that cuts like two hours out of my day right there. Inside this microwave, I don't know if you see right there, is some leftover pozole from last night. I told you I'm gonna have it for lunch today because it was so good. It's probably good the second day. Oh yeah, look at that. Woo wee! All right, guys, let's do a uh, day after um, real time taste test here. Let's see here. Let me try here. Mmm. Oh my god. So good. Mmm. 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 -hmm. Yeah, guys, it's like one o'clock and I have been stalling. <laughs> I was like, I was, um, ate lunch and then I was, uh, got caught up. I watched a little bit of WWE Network. Just watching some stuff. I just, you know, I just felt like chilling out and resting because when you get over a sickness, your body feels weak and that's, so I just chilled out right here on my couch for the last like hour or so, right here. Just wanted to get some rest. I just wanted to uh, take a deep breath because you know, one of the, I guess my, to my detriments, I guess, is I don't I give myself enough time to just rest, to just sit around and just take deep breaths because I'm always doing something. You know, I'm, always, I'm working, I'm working on eBay, I'm making my YouTube videos. You know, I'm sh I should make it a point to try to just, like on my day off today, just rest. You know, don't go full throttle all the time. But at the same time, if I don't, I feel like I'm letting myself uh, shortchange that I'm not going to accomplish what I need to accomplish. You know, my ultimate goal of um, getting my time back, you know, working for myself and getting my time back. That's why I'm always pushing myself to the limits. I'm always have a habit of uh, burning both candles on each side. And I know I should chill sometimes, just have days when I just chill. And I think some days I want to do it, but you know, I'm, I've said once, I've said it before, you know, time is the most important entity in your life. Once, because that's the one thing you can never get back. You can get money, you can lose weight, you can love your family, but time is, you can never get it back. And I always feel like I'm racing against time, you know? So, this made a point for the last two hours. Just to chill out and just watch a little bit of wrestling and just relax. But now I'm done. Because I'm going to go out now and get my oil changed, get my car washed, and then come back and see how I feel, maybe take another nap. And then work on eBay. Maybe. Alright guys, car is clean and vacuum and not as messy as it was before. If I'm, so if I'm anywhere near this place, I'm always going to stop by. Alright, I was in there for like maybe an hour and I actually had a lot of time to look through stuff, but I only found three pieces and one of them is good one I'm going to keep. So it wasn't that great of a find, but man, what can you do? Some days you find stuff, some days you don't. Alright, the family is out here. We're having dinner with our, with our friends at the top pizza places in the city. Metro Pizza. Stars of the vlog, right there. 
<laughs> you know, when I started doing the vlog, she never wanted to be on camera, and now she's like always on camera now. <laughs> she got over her shyness. about 8 46 right now I am um, sitting there editing the vlog that you're watching right now my family's actually next door our friends uh, the friends that you saw in the video watching a movie so I'm still a little bit under the weather so I didn't go plus I have to all that all I gotta do some eBay stuff I gotta do some listings so I'm gonna upload the vlog and end the vlog right here so you guys have a good night. Comment, like, and subscribe. Thanks for watching Ronnie Bizzle TV.